What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Operation Apocalypse video. My name is Pritikin and today we are hopping on board as you can tell with Sentinel. Now Sentinel, I believe they also adjusted his kit as opposed to Hyperfront, but Sentinel still to me playing a little bit more of like a sky. And what I mean by that is he has like seeking missiles and he's got a utility that is able to essentially um, detect the enemy wherever they may be. So let's go ahead and start right away. Uh, da, 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 da. So right now, his second ability here is is a essentially a a stun grenade. When I throw it, the enemies will actually slow down once they are hit within that specific AOE. I don't think it's going to really help us here in this section, but let's see what we're going to do. Now, I have not warmed up yet. It is literally first thing in my morning. So I know one is in that back corner there. Let's go ahead and nade that. There we go. Just like that. Is it me with spike? Yes, I have spike. So we're going to go in here, plant safely. Probably going to be coming from mid. Ooh, last literally last bullet in my clip and we got that triple first round in the book guys sentinel already feeling strong as you can see it, his kit does work really well so i already have my ultimate um and that does i believe like more like similar things like the uh the seekers the seek missiles um so the passive here when i throw it his first ability what it will do is it'll kind of like scan around and it'll, as soon as it will hit or detect someone it will show them on the radar so if i throw it right there let's see if we'll be able to detect somebody no nobody they didn't even make it over the wall am i able to retrieve it i can't no this is not like uh it is not like valorant in that sense so now watch nothing all right, hear them on the right side. I only have six bullets. Oh. All right, we still got him. So the ultimate doesn't really make <clears throat> as much sense. Um, like I said, when, when you do enter the site and it detects an individual, it, it does do a lot more. What we're going to do is we're going to try to go on A site here. See if that makes a little bit more sense. I already have it again, which is really interesting. All right, guys. So let me know in the comments below, guys. What are your thoughts so far on Operation Apocalypse? I think the game has improved significantly from... Actually, you know what? You know what his primary ability reminds me of? A little bit of a mix of Gecko's Flash, but with a... Um, with a enemy ping. Oh my god, give me that 5k. That's what Sentinel's primary reminds me of. Literally, it's like a... Um, it's thrown just like Gecko's Flash. Boom, there we go. We're destroying this game so far. We've got two more rounds. <clears throat> Let's try to get it. All right. So this time I will go and I'm going to go on A site. So it seems like that's where some of the guys were. And I'll go ahead and start the ultimate and see where we get there. But yeah, as I said, his primary here, you throw it, it hovers. But unlike Gecko, you're not able to retrieve it after it drops, um, which is very interesting. Um, all right. Let's see. Pop the ults. There's nothing we can do right off the bat. They automatically... See, it's on its way. Boom. And it I believe it flashes or stuns or the enemies as soon as they're on site. Let's go ahead and plant again. One's already respawned. One's going to be coming from mid. Oh, hello. Nice lag. Oh, so close. But my, my teammate got my back right there. They're coming right here. They're still mid. There we go. So, I will say, unlike Hyperfront, I felt like the footsteps in Hyperfront was very 
Like, you, you couldn't tell which direction people are coming from. They've clearly fixed that here. No one's, no one's cheering for me. You know what? But you guys should cheer for me. Make sure to smash that like button in this video. And subscribe for more Operation Apocalypse content as we are roaming. Hopefully to a launch. Uh, more regions other than China. As we know that, uh, you know, as filming this, it is March 27th. Tomorrow is the last uh, day of the beta. And of course, the beta is only from 6 a.m. to 1 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, <clears throat> so for someone like me who works full time, it's kind of difficult. But we're here. It's early morning and we're, we're trying our best. So I'm going to try to throw him way up over. See if he's able to detect them. No. Does seem like it is a full B push. So we're going to be on our way here. Alright, alright. I'm gonna go ahead and try to slow them down here. Just any sort of stuns. Here's one. Two. Last one was there. There we go, baby. Let's get the spike out. Alright, go ahead. You do it. You do it, girl. Oh no, there's one more! <laughs> Let's go, man. What a way. Woo. Guys, as you can tell, Sentinel is very much a control agent, and it feels really well to play him. But still, overall, I think the gameplay in general, man, of Operation Apocalypse is incredible. I am happy to play this game again while we are waiting for Valorant Mobile. But more importantly, guys, make sure to smash that like button, hit subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.